welcome back to the Girls Inc. YouTube channel. Today we're going to be making fall mindfulness jars. So if you don't know what that is, you'll see in a second. But basically the glitter in the jar can represent your thoughts and feelings. So at first, it's most likely to be settled at the bottom of the jar as your thoughts may be calm. And then if you start to get flustered or upset or angry and you don't know how to cope with those feelings, you can shake the jar, the glitter is going to go a little crazy just as your thoughts might be, but you can take the time while the glitter is going around the jar to gather your thoughts, collect your feelings, and figure out your next steps as it comes to settle. So to start our activity, I'm going to take a walk outside and go in the woods to try to find a cute little twig that's going to fit inside our mason jar. For the materials, all you're going to need is a twig, fall confetti, a mason jar, glycerin, a hot glue gun, and some glitter which I'll show later. I need to make sure that my twig will fit in the mason jar so I'm just going to size that up and I can see that it doesn't fit so I'm just ripping it and then I'll be able to hot glue it in. I'm putting hot glue in the center of the lid and then placing the twig on that and just gluing around it a little bit to make sure it's secured. I'm now opening my pack of fall confetti and I'm going to hot glue it onto the twig and just make it look like a cute little fall tree so you can decorate it however you'd like. Once you're done decorating your little tree, you want to fill the jar up with warm water to almost the top, but not quite. Next, we'll be adding glitter, and I'm using USA Glitter. It's non-toxic, earth-friendly, and biodegradable, made by one of our own Girls Inc. members. Her name is Rumi, and this stuff is so cute, and she started this own business herself, so of course we're going to support her. Now we're using glycerin and there isn't a set amount that you need to use but I used a decent amount because I want the glitter to be swirling for a longer amount of time. Once you add the glitter in you just want to stir everything up real good and I added extra leaves just for fun to make my jar look more fall like. The last step is putting our little tree into the jar so all you're doing is tipping it upside down and screwing it on and you are all set. So you can use this anytime you're feeling upset and it's a really good mindfulness tool to help us stay calm and relaxed when things might seem crazy. After finishing my mindfulness jar, I definitely feel really good about it and I think I'm going to use it as a little bit of fall decor as well in my room. I think I'm going to put it on the table behind me with our candles and if you liked it, definitely give us a thumbs up, like and subscribe to our YouTube channel. You can like us on Facebook and follow us on Instagram. That'll all be linked below. So I hope you enjoy. Bye.